Hey, well, uh, welcome to another episode of my guess. Play this, not that. Um, I was gonna keep doing Let's Plays of Bioshock Infinite, but I just can't. I don't like it. Um, even from the start, even like 90 minutes in, I don't like it. And maybe I'll try to give it dual di due diligence, but I just was not having fun playing it at all. I, I mean, you know, maybe it is something where I just didn't give it enough of a chance, but I didn't like the stupid turrets I had to deal with. I didn't like um, just being kind of in that um, kind of grinder of cops for so long. Uh, you know. But this game, oops, this game's great. Um, you know, it's enjoyable, it's difficult to a point. Um, it's a nice, really fun kind of FPS type game. Uh, it's got a lot of arcadey stuff in it, like you could dodge the bullets and you have to pick which way to dodge the bullet. If you pick wrong, you get shot. And if you get shot while doing that, you just die. I don't know about the other difficulties, but you just up and die. Um, you know, you're always getting upgrades, so it's kind of cool. It's like, a, uh, oops. Oops. It's kind of cool as an RPG hybrid where there are upgrades and stuff like that, and you can upgrade your weapons. It's not entirely deep, but it's good. Um, you know, where, where Infinite... I don't know what they expected to make the game fun. Like, like I should just be happy with it because it got a bunch of um, high ratings. I don't know, or should be happy with it because um, Bioshock 1 was a very popular game. I'm not really sure. Um, I hated the first Call of Juarez, then, um, what, it, what it was it called? Blood Brothers was really fun. And uh, there you go. Did he just dodge a damn bullet? Like, the fucking... Where the hell is that guy? Oh, there he is. <laughs> but th then you've got Bioshock Infinite where I eat the guy's hot dog and he doesn't say anything. And it, it feels very dead. And it's like they're supposed to be giving me this amazing experience. But they're not, really. And the first Bioshock... It was fun, for sure, but it was more because it was kind of like a Metroid-esque FPS with a really strong narrative and really good, um, what would you call them, really good set pieces, you know, like where, um, what is it, you kill, um, uh, what's the fucker's name? Ricky Libertarian. You kill Ricky Libertarian, and um, he's like, he makes you beat him to death with his golf club. Standing together against anyone who would threaten them. And it's like, a man chooses, and whatever. It was a nice set piece, but the game was just a collection of that. In the end, the story wasn't very good um, at all. The story was just like, okay, well, like, did you, did you harvest one of the little sisters? Well, you're Hitler. Um, did you not? Harvest and the Little Sisters, congratulations, you're Mahatma Gandhi for not killing little girls. That makes you Mahatma Gandhi and killing one little girl, even though they're like really creepy demon little girls and obviously couldn't be properly rehabilitated. Um, killing one makes you Hitler and that's it. You know, even though you're killing shit tons of people who have similar circumstances where they're fucked up and they done too many drugs so they're doing awful shit whatever um, you know it's like the original Bioshock just it, it's one of those things where the game was cool but it got conflated as being the most amazing game ever and that sort of happened with Infinite as well but Infinite's much worse gameplay wise I mean it starts off and it's boring you start off in Bioshock uh, one and it's got a good introduction then you get out there and you're hitting people with your wrench and you're getting power-ups and they're it. cool a goddamn steamboat 
A steamboat? In a swamp? Yeah, Steve, but this wasn't much more than a wreck, really. But how'd a damn steamboat end up in the swamps? Yes, it floated off during the flood of 89. Now, was it a stern wheeler or, or a side wheeler? What, what? Does that really make a difference, Steve? It was a steamboat with a goddamn army on board. It was in that a fusillade of bullets come raining down from our house, and those vigilantes who accompanied me weren't anywhere to be found. Now that was a little annoying, but hey, I could shoot them back through the wall. Some familiar faces. Whoops. But yeah, I like this because it's arcadey and it, it's more like a um, like a light gun shooter. Like you get in these situations and people are just there and it's a big shootout, rather than um, infinite, where infinite feels like I don't know. It just feels like an asshole with uh, the Duke 3D level designer. Really, like I I really did not like the start of it. Um, maybe it was a mistake for playing on hard, but, you know, bio the first Bioshock was so fucking easy. Um, also, when I was streaming, my FPS sucked. And, oh, I have to get inside the steamboat. Hold on. But see, it's kind of neat, because you can uh, rack up these bonuses and that's what gives you new abilities so like I mean it's not like a fucking super difficult game at least in story mode but there is a whoops uh, there and sorry about hitting the mic there there is like an arcade mode and there's stuff like that you know it doesn't necessarily the story mode doesn't necessarily have to be the challenging mode of it um, And I, uh... <laughs> I just, I'm having a lot more fun with this than uh, Infinite. And Infinite something I only want to play just to, like understand or illustrate how it's not so good so it's not even like i expect to enjoy the game i probably will enjoy parts of it i've really enjoyed the um erotic gifts produced of elizabeth in 3d modeling programs but somewhere up there the dolphins were waiting on me you know it just uh just wasn't that great I think I'll end this now, so you don't have uh, the boss fight spoil for you. But yeah, I, I might try to go back to Infinite, but I don't know. This is a lot more fun, and a lot of other games are a lot more fun, and I'm sure this game didn't get a bunch of 10 out of 10s, unfortunately. Uh, well, that's me, signing off. Bye.